So I'm Chris Chappell. Um, I'm from Gusano's Pizzeria in Little Rock, Arkansas. Um, I, my brother, uh, Tim Chappell, is the owner of the restaurant. And so um, I'm sort of a jack of all trades, but essentially I'm working with him to uh, focus on back of house systems, but also he brought me on to help with um, training. A considerable amount of training. He, he understood even before he came to PALS uh, five, six months ago that training was of utmost importance to have the restaurant running well and to really help our, uh, I mean, help our customers uh, to have the best experience possible. Um, so I was brought on to help with training and also some uh, improving our systems, uh, checklists, really everything we can do to try to improve the guest experience. Um, it's been great for me to come to this session of PALS because uh, after Tim left five months ago, he came back with a lot of really great ideas that were reinforcing a lot of the things that he had thought about before in his 10 years or more of working in a restaurant. And so for me, it's really fun to come today and yesterday to the training because so many of the things that he has brought back to, uh, to us at the restaurant, I'm seeing um, how that was trained to him and how that is folded in. So some of the fun ones, you know, when he comes back and we say, well, we've got a, you know, Tim, I've got a, um, a, a staff issue I need to work through. And he said, he said, well, you know, it's not the staff member's fault. It's our fault for not having the right system. So when, when, when our trainers here brought that up today, it was, uh, I'd already heard that many a time that we need to improve our systems. Um, you know, other things, certainly the emphasis on a clean operation, cleanliness is key. That's a huge part of what he already knew, but brought back to reinforce with the staff. Um, and I think where our challenge is, is to try to integrate all of those things into systems that create that culture to where everyone knows at all times what exactly what they need to be doing to maintain the levels of cleanliness that we want. Um, additionally, I think one of the things that I've seen a big impact on the restaurant has been the orientation um, and that setting the expectations for how that staff member will be part of the team from day one. It makes things a lot easier when we can go back and look at the orientation and say, but look, you've agreed to uh, do this in the store as part of how we want to run this operation to give our customers the best experience. And so having that base has really helped in trying to do that. And so it, really it's interesting perspective for me because I've heard things from him that are now being reinforced by my being here, but we are seeing the result, good results of that happening already.